Welcome to Santiago. We're Emily and Danny, and we've been traveling by van for four years with our cat Graham and dog Sombrita. Our transmission broke while we were in the Bolivian Andes, so we're bringing you along as we check out Santiago while, we, while it gets fixed up. Make sure to subscribe and ring the bell so that you never miss a part of our journey. Hey! We have our buddy coming to see us. So we're gonna show a rob around with you guys. Look who came to visit us in Santiago. <laughs> rob went up and over the Andes Mountains by a bus to visit us here. And here we are on our first big attraction. Yeah. The cable car. And Danny is as mad as ever. <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's obsessed with the tallest building in the world. We're going up it. From one great view to another, we're heading up the tallest building in South America. Now we're at the very top of the building, open sky. <laughs> There's the shadow of the building all the way to there. Cool. <laughs> Tallest building in South America, right outside our window. On my birthday, we met Christian, a snowboarder from Santiago. We took him up on the offer to, to take us back up to El Colorado. Oh, you packed in there, Emily. <laughs> we have some Vita's dog walker, Maria, coming today to hang out with the pets while we head up. Okay, here comes our first view of the Valle Nevado area, right around the mountain here. I was so afraid of tow ropes, I considered switching to skiing this year. In the US, it's almost always a chairlift, so it's so much easier to hop on and off. But we're so lucky that Christian helped me really understand how to get on and off of a tow rope without hurting myself or others <laughs> by sliding down the mountain. And earlier today, we found out the mechanic has ordered some parts for the van. So hopefully he'll be able to work on that pretty quick and we'll be able to get the van back soon. around 
down. Emily's getting taught a bit about these tow ropes by the snowboarder friends. I would never take a tow rope if I didn't have to, but that's how you have to get around. <laughs> I'm feeling better, but that last one, yeah, he said lean back and I was like, oh, I'm about to lose my foot and can't lean back. <laughs> So we have been having the best time skiing up in El Colorado in Santiago here. While we were up there on my birthday, we saw a whole crew of people with these crazy 80s onesies that looked so cool. And I was like, where did you get those? And they told us the street where there's a whole bunch of thrift shops. So today I've decided to make our skiing a little bit more old fashioned or fashionable, I guess. We are heading over to the street and we're gonna go and find ourselves some dope onesies. We're gonna go take you guys on the metro and find ourselves some awesome ski outfits. Kids. You want to go on that one, Emily? Okay, while we're getting ramen, comment which onesie you think each of us chose. We had such an awesome time just picking out our onesies, trying all of them on in all of these different thrift stores. Really an awesome way to spend the afternoon, but now we can actually use our onesies because tomorrow we're going skiing with, and I've washed them and dried them today, so don't worry, there's no 80s dust on them. <laughs> so we're gonna start packing up, and yeah, then we'll see you guys tomorrow for some for a ski day. This time we're taking up the ski van, which is 15,000 Colombian pesos each.
first ones he put on up at the mountain. There it is. <laughs> you look good. <laughs> you look good, baby. You. <laughs> Emily's getting used to these tow ropes. There's a lot more in South America. Really no big deal, just chilling. It's been such an amazing time up here at El Colorado. My onesie, I was a little bit worried, honestly, that it would be not waterproof anymore because I think this is probably 40 years old, but it is super waterproof. I am so warm, like crazy warm. I feel like these were a joke at first and I'm beginning to love it. <laughs> We found an amazing powder patch here up a tow rope that no one's really even on. We have this whole field to ourselves. The tow ropes have been getting easier and easier. It's barely even a thing to get on it anymore. The only thing with the tow rope is you can't eat snacks on them. <laughs> but we stopped for a nice snack together. We're about to start into high season here at El Colorado. So today is the last day we're gonna have some cheap tickets if you like this video, please share it and subscribe. And if you'd like to support us a little bit more, check out our Patreon. Thanks so much for coming along. We'll see you guys next time.